In this video, we'll go through exam questions that cover the criteria identify and recognize common 2D and 3D shapes, including circle, cube, rectangle, and triangle. You can locate the questions on the MassMath.com website under Entry 1. The questions come from different exam boards. We'll start with the non-calculated questions, and then we'll move to the calculated questions. Here is the first question. Badges come in different shapes. Which of these shapes is a circle? Tick your answer. So circle, this shape here, if you ever get confused, circle begins with C, so that looks very much like a circle, the C, the letter, and it's also the letter that clock starts with, and a clock typically is in the shape of a circle, so that can help you remember. What is the name of this shape? Again, that's a circle. Now we move into the calculated questions. Lila needs a table with a square top. Which table has a square top? So square, like a square napkin. It has equal sides. So that's this one here. Rita needs a sign for the fun run. She chooses a sign with the shape of a triangle. Triangle. Tri, like the spelling looks like three. So it has three sides, three angles. That's this shape here. Rob drives around the city and sees road signs. He sees a sign that is round and another sign that is a triangle. Tick the signs he sees. One of them that is round, that's this one here. And a triangle, that's this one here. The helmet is in a box. Name the 3D shape of the box. So this shape is a cube. Just like an ice cube or a sugar cube. Evie takes some shampoo bottles out of a box. This is the shape of the box. What is the name of this 3D shape? Again, this is a cube. The shape of the computer power button is a triangle. Which of these shapes is a triangle? Tick your answer. So this is a triangle. One of the parcels is a cube. Which of these shapes is a cube? Tick your answer. So this is a cube. The other three shapes are cuboids. As you can see, they longer. Dylan sets up the horse jumps. Which jump has triangles on it? Tick your answer. A has rectangles. B has triangles. C has circles, and D has half circles. We call those semicircles. So we're looking for the ones with triangles on it, and we've ticked that. So option B is the correct one. The baker has these biscuits. Tick the square biscuits the baker needs for the order. So we're looking for the square biscuits. And that's this one, 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 and this one. 
The other shapes are either circles or rectangles. What is the name of this shape? So it has three angles, three sides. So this is the triangle. What is the name of this shape? This is a rectangle. It looks similar to a square, but it's longer. Even the word rectangle is longer than the word square. So that can help you remember. A woman parks her car in a car park at the airport. The car park has four zones. She sends her husband a text message. Hi, the car is in the zone with a circle. Which zone did the woman park in? So we've got a circle here, and that's zone two. Take the biscuit that is in the shape of a triangle. That's this one here. And this is the end of the questions.